Hi guys, glad to see you in this video, why we are talking about when there are founds in Odoo. I hope you will find this video helpful, so let's get started. Refund option can be found in accounting module. Under the vendors menu, we have refunds. We can generate refunds directly from here, or we can do it inside the purchase module. When you create and confirm a purchase order, you will create a vendor bill. Let's dive into it. So after creating and confirming a bill, if you find any mistake in the generated invoice, or if in situation like where the services are rejected, or the products are returned to the vendor, or in cases where the delivered products are damaged, all you need to add a credit note. So let's click on the credit note button. Now from here, you can give a reason for your credit note. For example, item came broken. Then click on reverse here. That's going to create a new draft reversal for the vendor bill. Here you can see all your products. You can delete some products or change their quantity. If you are sending our items back to our vendor, that's going to create a stock move. And if you are using automated inventory evaluation, what that move is going to do is debit our stock in turn received and credit our stock valuation. But sometimes instead we might put that in our scrap location. Maybe the vendor says, okay, it is broken, I don't need that, we can just throw it out. So in that case, we are going to move that to our scrap location. And we might have different accounts set to, to our scrap location. So after you check the correctness of all of this, you can confirm. Now you see that our vendor credit note has a different sequence of our bill. Remember that, now we go to the accounting. And inside the accounting, you have journal entries. Let's filter these entries by purchases. Okay. Here you can see the reversal bill which was created right now, and below you see the purchase bill. In the reference line, you can see the reversal of which bill it is, and the reason that we gave for the invoice. Okay, so this is how you can add a credit note, but we have one more method. Now let's go back directly to the refund step. Here you will also see all the reverse bills. To create a new refund, just click on the new button. Now from here, you need to add the vendor and the product you want to refund. Then, give the bill date here. After that, you can confirm it. The reversal bill is created. Go back and you will see it. It will also be reflected in the journal entries. So, that's all about the refunds and credit notes. Thank you for watching.